In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize the appearance of your Ideal Directory's website. So, from your dashboard, come over and click on Appearance and Design. And the first thing we're going to do is upload our professionally designed logo. If you don't have a professionally designed logo yet, that's okay. Contact our support team and we'll fill you in on pricing and turnaround time and all the details you need. So, once you have your logo, we're going to hit Choose File. Okay, then let's see, I have my logo here. Um, you won't see it right away, but when you click Save, it will appear. Now we're going to click on View Website just to take a look at the logo. Now we'll go back over to Appearance and Design and change the fonts. We're going to choose fonts that match our logo fonts. You don't have to match exactly, but this is a sans serif font, meaning the letters don't have the extra decoration on them. So I'm going to go with something similar and we will use Nobile for the titles. And we're going to change Open Sans to Encode Sans for the paragraph or body font. Click Save. Go over and refresh. So you can see the slight change to the fonts that we just chose. Next, we'll change the colors. For the header background, in most cases, you're going to want to leave that white because it's going to look best with your logo. Same with the header text. The default color black is perfect with white background. For the accent color, you're going to want to choose one of the colors from your logo. And I'll show you how to do that. You can either slide these two settings here or get the exact text number and type that in to change the color. So this is a blue that's in the logo. Okay, I'm going to save that change. Now in order to get a really good look at colors here, we'll change the button color to match the orange in my logo. And if you do have your hex color, you can also paste it in here. Alright, so we'll save the change. Okay then I'm going to select a new hero image. You can upload your own. We've provided you with something to get started with. So let's save that and then take a look at the site. So you can really see with just a couple changes how much you can customize the look and feel of the site. So we'll click into a listing and you can see the blue color I chose the accent color um, is now the color of buttons and the footer background color. Go back to the home page. We also changed the button color to orange, so that's where you're going to see that reflected. And we'll go back, and now we can also change the layout of the home page search box. So we'll select vertical keep it center justified. We've already changed the button color. So now with the final customization we'll make in this video, we're going to change the button text from search to, let's go with go in this case. Click save, refresh the page, and you can see how it's a nice secondary option for a different layout for the home page search box. So today we have added a professionally designed logo, changed our fonts to match the logo, changed our accent color, selected a new hero image, and customized the look and layout of our home page search box.